Chicken here, bring you another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, very excited. This is going to be sneak peek number one of the new December update coming to Boom Beach. So, what is coming in this update, guys? We are going to be going over the new snowy base, uh, the temporary gunboat ability, and the new decorations tab, guys. So, this is what we have loaded up here. Where did we get this? You go into the building, and you see there's the economy, there's the defense, there's the support. And then there's this new tab called decorations, guys. And we also have, aside from the beach mystery, we also have decorations that haven't come out yet. But we are free to speculate on what those could be, guys. So I'm going to go out on a limb here and say maybe for each, like, holiday season or, like, uh, whatever you call those things, like Halloween and that kind of stuff. I'm thinking there's going to be decorations that come out for this, and they're probably going to go into this tab. But Chicken's going out on a limb on that one, guys. Let me know what you think of that down below in the comments. So... Uh, the Beach Mystery increases troops, troops, in, increases troops cheer and presentfulness by 80%. It doesn't actually do anything, guys, but it looks cool. It looks cool. It's different. And you see Dr. Terrence has actually plugged a camera into the tree, and it, uh, it, it pops out every now and then. We'll see it here in a minute. So you'll see that our base, this isn't a dev build stuff. We are in the dev build, but this isn't a weird dev build glitch. Our base is actually going to be temporarily a snowy base, which is kind of cool because it's Christmas, it's winter. Uh, our base kind of reflects that with the new uh, kind of style and look of uh, the Christmas stuff. So while we're waiting for the video camera to pop out, we also have, once we unlock the, uh, the beach mystery, there's Dr. Terrence's. video camera that's what we were talking about guys we also have a new temporary uh gunboat ability so this ability is going to be here for two weeks it's a limited time um just like everything in this update it's just a limited time but uh we're gonna have the cryo bomb now you're probably thinking chicken that's great but how do i use the cryo bomb to my advantage well you came to the right spot guys so we're gonna be going over uh, in a massive attack operation, guys, how you can solo any and every single base using the cryobomb to your advantage. So, the biggest thing about the cryobomb, why I like it so much, um, just look at the amount of mines I'm able to clear. I can get every single mine that's going to be in my way um, with for the cost of 6 GB, which is pretty crazy. Because usually that would take a barrage and an, art and, an art and an artillery, which is like 13 GB. So, uh, you're going to save a lot of GB clearing mines and... On this dev build account, I'm actually running zero troop health uh, statue, so it's definitely, definitely beneficial for uh, for running over mines. So you'll see right here, we'll get up to the top, and the uh, the cryo bomb not only clears mines, but it also works as kind of like a poor man's shock if you don't have enough GBE for an actual shock bomb, and just if you have extra GBE for areas like this, like sniper towers and stuff, you can really slow them down. Uh, using the cryo bomb, so you see right there, all the single target uh, defenses. I'm actually able to, um, I'm actually able to to slow them down so much that they're barely even firing at the zookas. I throw another one down on the sniper tower, and it's just too easy, guys. It's just too easy. So there's the cryo bomb, there's the snowy base, there's the temporary gunboat ability, and the thing I'm most excited about, I think that everyone else will be too, is this decorations tab, and it's going to be fun to see what else comes out for this uh, coming forward. So let's just go ahead, let's just play around a little bit on uh, on our map here, guys, with some uh, with some cryobomb um, attacks. So we're going to go ahead and take down some ice bases here. All this all in the dev build, guys. And uh, yeah, so, um, so what we can do here, instead of using two artilleries, which would be 7 GB, I think, or something like that, we can go like this. And we can just take down everything, and we can also throw out our troops a little bit earlier, and not have to not have to sweat about the delay for once. Now there is a bug on this build. I'm not sure if it's in. I'm, I'm going to mention it to the team, but uh, right now, whenever I double tap, nothing actually happens. But I'm sure that'll be fixed. But it, it might be an, an iOS thing. But uh, I'm sure that'll be fixed by the time the update actually comes out. If that is a, a build-related issue, see right there, it's doing it again. Holy jeez, man! So. Uh, yeah, we'll get up onto the HQ and then we'll we'll do something like this. So we'll throw down we'll throw down a cryo bomb to take to take care of all of the um, all the single target stuff. We'll shock we'll shock all the splash damage things and uh, take a look at this, guys. We're able to just use our extra GB that we save with the cryo bomb to actually go ahead and take down the HQ on this six ice base. So um, yeah, I think that's basically 
all we wanted to show for uh for the first update uh for the first update guys so make sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel make sure to um make sure to hit the bell for notifications because we are actually going to be posting uh multiple sneak peeks for this update and it's really really exciting guys i can't wait for you to see the rest of it so that's gonna wrap it up for sneak peek number one guys make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting entertaining or informative and we'll see you in the next one guys chicken out first.